Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in the last class we have seen that formation of PDE by, by the method of eliminating arbitrary constants. So in this video we shall start the formation of PDE by method of eliminating arbitrary functions. So in this here we uh, here we eliminate the arbitrary functions given. Okay. So let us start with an example. Form PDE by the method of eliminating arbitrary functions from the following. Z is, first one z is equals to f of x square minus y square. Solution. Given that z is equals to f of x minus y sorry x square minus y square. So here also we differentiate given function with respect to x and y partially separately. Okay. So let us give an equation as equation 1 f of x square minus y square equals to 1. Now differentiate this equation 1 partially with respect to x first. Differentiating partially with respect to x we get dou z by dou x equals to f dash of x square minus y square into x square differentiation is 2x. Or it can be written as this term is written as p equals to f dash of x square minus y square into 2x or f dash of x square minus y square can be written as p divided by 2x. So let us consider this as equation 2. Now again differentiating this given equation with respect to y partially. So that is differentiate equation 1 partially with respect to y so that we get dou z divided by dou y is equals to f dash of x square minus y square into now y square differentiation is minus 2y that is minus 2y or it can be written as q equals to f dash of x square minus y square into 2x sorry 2y so that we get f dash of x square minus y square equals to q divided by minus 2y. Consider this as equation 3. Now you can observe that from the equation 2 and 3, LHS side is same so that we can equate the RHS side. So that is equating equation 2 and 3, we get p divided by 2x is equals to minus q divided by 2y. 2, 2 get cancels. We get p into y. So this minus and we take it as plus. That is taking LHS side we get plus q into x equals to 0. This is the required pd. Second one z is equals to f of x plus ay plus g of x minus ay. So consider the given equation as equation 1. So you can observe that here we have two functions f and g. So when we have two functions we have to differentiate two times. That is we have to find the partial derivative of second order. Okay. See here this is the given equation. Let this as equation 1. Now differentiate this partially with respect to x first. So differentiating partially with respect to x we get dou z by dou x is equals to f dash of x plus a y into x differentiation is 1 plus g dash of x minus a y. Okay. So this can be represented by p. So, so that we get p is equals to f dash of x plus a y plus g dash of x minus a y. Now again differentiating with respect to x only so that we get dou square z divided by dou x square equals to f double dash of x that is f dash f double dash x plus a y plus g double dash x minus a y ok so this is represented by so second order differentiation with respect to x is uh, represented by R. Okay. 
so this we represent it by r so r equals to we get f double dash of x plus a y plus g double dash of x minus a y consider this as you, can, you may consider this as equation 1 sorry equation 2 and this one as equation 3 now differentiating equation 1 that is given equation 1 partially with respect to y differentiating with respect to x the y we get dou z by dou y and it is denoted by q okay q equals to we get f dash of x plus a y and this a y differentiation is a plus g dash of x minus a y into minus a y differentiation is minus a so that we get q equals to we can take a outside we get f dash of x plus a y plus g dash of x minus a y so we write it as minus okay consider this as equation 4 now again differentiating this q that is dou z by dou y with respect to y again differentiate partially with respect to y so we get dou square dou z divided by dou y square is equals to a we take outside f dash of x plus a y into a y differentiation is a minus g dash of x minus a y into a y differentiation is minus a y so again we can take a outside taking a outside a square equals to we get sorry here we get f double dash f double dash of x plus a y minus into minus we get plus g double dash of x minus a y ok so or it can be written as a square equals to you can observe that f double dash of x plus a y g double dash of x minus a y is nothing but it is r from the equation 3 we get its value is equals to r so we can represent it by r Okay, dou square z divided by dou y square means it is t. So, we get the required pd is equals to t equals to a square into r. So, this is our required pd. So, this is from the equation 3. Okay, so this is required pd. So, like this, when we have two functions, so then we have to differentiate two times. That is, we have to find the partial derivatives of second order. Next example, from the PDE, given that z, that is by the eliminating functions, arbitrary functions, given that z is equal to y of f of x plus x into g of y. Differentiating this function, you can observe that here also, it contains two functions f and g ok let z is equals to y into f of x plus x into g of y so let this as equation 1 now differentiate equation 1 partially with respect to x so we get dou z by dou x equals to it is represented by p now differentiating this y being constant f dash of x plus x differentiation 1 g of y consider this as equation 2 now again differentiating equation 1 partially with respect to y so we get dou z divided by dou y is equals to q equals to now differentiating with respect to y we get f of x equals to y differentiation 1 plus x taken outside g dash of y. This is equation we consider it as equation 3. Now consider xp plus yq. So, x as it is substitute p value from the equation 2 it is y f dash of x plus g of y plus 
y into q value is f of x plus x into g dash of y or it can be written as x y f dash of x plus x into g of y plus y f of x plus x y g dash of y or it can be written as x y taken outside f dash of x plus g dash of y plus x g of y plus y f of x or it can be further written as x into y f dash of x plus g dash of y plus this is nothing but the given equation 1 so it is replaced by z so this is from equation 1 now we differentiate this equation 3 with respect to sorry equation 2 with respect to y or equation 3 with respect to x you can differentiate in the both way so differentiating equation 2 with respect to y so we get dou square z divided by dou x into dou y so now partially differentiating with respect to y we get f dash of x constant y differentiation sorry f dash of x differentiation is so we are differentiating with respect to y so it is f dash of x y differentiation is 1 plus g dash of g of y differentiation is g dash of y we substitute this value into the this given equation sorry this equation or if we consider this as equation 4 now substituting this value in equation 4 so dou square z divided by dou x into dou y is represented by yes so that equation 4 implies that xp plus yq is equals to x into y f dash of x plus g dash of y is nothing but it is yes plus z okay or xp plus yq is equals to x y into s plus z so this is required pd